The holidays are over. Are you ready to start eating healthier? Angela Kelly's learning a few recipes in Oshkosh this morning. Some great ideas so far, Ange. Yeah, really good stuff. I tell you, I don't know about you, Rachel, but I eat a lot of mashed potatoes over the holidays. They're yeah, one of my favorite helpings. things. Yeah. Oh, they're so good. But we know too many can kind of add to the waistline. And so we're lightening it up a bit with what? What are we doing here, Linda? This is actually steamed cauliflower. And uh, we're just going to add a little bit of olive oil and salt and pepper to taste. Okay. And maybe for the first time that you serve this to your family, you might want to mix it half potatoes and half cauliflower um, and run it through the food processor. It's really going to give it uh, the texture of creamy mashed potatoes. Okay. Did we, so, do you want me to? Yep, okay, we'll just we'll add a little bit. That. And can I add some pepper for yep, you? give that a. I love this gadget please. she has here. <laughs> Tell me when. That's probably just fine. Okay. And we'll give it a little salt shake. Little salt. And this is great, just simple ingredients. This is all you need, right? That's it. Okay. Um, like I said, it depends on how creamy you want it. And then we're going to add it to our plate of meatloaf for a balanced meal. Yeah, absolutely. And I've actually, um, I've had something similar to this before. And Rachel, I know you would agree. It's, it really is a, a pretty tasty substitute if you're looking to um, watch your waistline. Now you can see that um, she's paired it up with her healthy brown rice meatloaf that she made. And we wanted to give you an example of also, Linda is a personal chef. She, her business is called My Culinary Angel. And the majority of her clients um, are hiring her because they want to eat healthy. And explain what you're doing here. This is actually what you would uh, come home to find in your refrigerator or your freezer. I package it all um, so it's easy to heat up either in the microwave or the oven, depending on your preference. I put a lid on it and tuck it in your refrigerator, and uh, it's ready to go. Mm -hmm. And uh, she's got a great website that um, answers a lot of questions, and we put a link to that on fox11online.com. Also on our website, you're going to find all of the recipes for the food that Linda made for us this morning. Um, remember the granola bars earlier this morning? These are so good. I tried one. Uh, these creamy chicken enchiladas look amazing. And of course, the meatloaf and the cauliflower mash, all the recipes on our website. So we hope you took something away from it this mm -hmm. morning. And uh, thank you so much for You're having welcome. us. Mm -hmm. Okay, back to you guys. Wish I could take a bite out of it. Thanks, Ange. Let's Bye. check in with Pete. He's